at HRT. Your work has very direct impact and seeing the strategy that you came up with, make money or lose money and diagnosing, you know, why it's doing well or not doing well, I think that's very interesting and also very motivating. My name is Cindy, I'm an Algo developer at HRT and I'm on a sub team that does systematic arbitrage. Algo developers at HRT research and implement the trading strategies and we're involved in the initial ideation of what kind of products to trade and what kind of strategies to explore and then actually delving into the research and back testing those strategies and then rolling them out to live and monitoring them. So an algo developer would be often considered maybe a quant researcher or a quant trader at another firm. A few things make HRT algo devs unique. One is our focus on automation so we really try to make our strategies as systematic as possible. And so most algo devs are very strong coders and there's an emphasis on writing systematic strategies. That's why this role is great. You get to use university level math, statistics, machine learning on a pretty regular basis. And I think that's very unique for an industry role. Getting to think about those problems on a daily basis is really fun. At a high level, my team looks for arbitrage opportunities between products that have relationships with each other. And this could be applied to so many different asset classes. And one of the main challenges is to just figure out what we want to work on. What is the market opportunity? What is the size of a market? What kind of edge do we think we can provide? And what portion of the existing market could we saturate? And then the next challenge is actually doing the research on the strategies and then rolling them out to live and monitoring them. I really enjoy working on my team because it feels like I'm building a small business with like a dozen or so people and it's a very entrepreneurial spirit. So I feel like we're constantly thinking about ways to improve or ways to grow the team, but we have have the support of like a much more mature business and much larger firm behind us. Another important component is collaborating across teams. So because we have a single code base, there's a lot more resources that my team can leverage. For example, my team is on the newer side. Leveraging the existing uh, infrastructure at HRT has been really critical to our ability to hit the ground running and not having to write that from scratch has been really helpful. My day-to-day -day is pretty self-directed. I usually have a balance between research and then also collaborating with team members to monitor some of our existing trading. I'm also involved in doing code reviews for other people on my team and kind of giving feedback. We mostly code in Python um, and C++ as well. We also do a lot of our research in things like Pandas or Jupyter Notebooks. You definitely don't need a strong financial background to come into this role. Most people learn the finance knowledge needed on the job. Even the day-to-day -day is not very finance focused at all. Eventually you'll boil it down to a technical problem that is abstracted away from the finance and more about the math and statistics and quantitative thinking. I grew up in Chicago. I've always been really into math and STEM and the sciences, but uh, going into MIT, I majored in computer science and I did a couple internships in tech, which I liked, but I realized that I did want a more quantitative aspect to my work. I had heard a lot of good things about HRT and one thing that really stood out to me was people emphasized the open culture here and also the open code base which is really unique so I've been here for a little over a year. Outside of work I really enjoy exploring New York City. I like to travel. I've been doing some hiking in the area and I really value work-life balance and it's nice that I always have that flexibility of pursuing hobbies outside of work. I really love working at HRT because I think it's one of the best places for someone looking to just learn as much as possible and grow as much as possible. I like that I kind of have a lot of flexibility in where I want my career to go at HRT. There's a lot of different kind of roles and projects and types of work that I can be involved in and I get to choose that path.